shot. Down the ground for four. Another top shot from uh, Sachin Tandulka. It was over pitched. They had to be driven. And he made no mistake in putting that ball between the stumps and mid on. And as uh, Ravi said a moment ago, it's a lush outfield, but it's a fast outfield. Firmly anchored on the front foot as he made contact. High elbow, directing the ball to the boundary. A great atmosphere at this ground when it's uh, full, like it's today. That's a big hit. No ball signal, and it might have just cleared the rope for six. And a 50 comes up for Indian style. He picked it up very well indeed. No ball, perhaps he'd have just heard the call as he unbound himself. But the important thing was that uh, he got it on the middle of the bat, a good big stride forward. Uh, that's what helped him to hit the ball on the rise. That's cheeky. Very cheeky from Tendulka. The clouds love it. Great improvisation from Sachin Tendulka. Picked the line very early, moved right across the stumps. But he could do that because the ball was close enough to him and very nicely paddled away wide of the fine leg fielder. Very optimistic. Now what's very interesting to see here when the appeal was made where the umpire was. Now normally you would want an umpire right behind the stumps when a bowler appeals. Have a look at this. Big shout from Was. He thought it was pretty close. Just pitching around leg stump. Certainly worth a shout. Didn't bounce very much. Yes, he's done well there. He's He's been very still. He saw that the ball hit the pad and he was still right behind the stumps and then made the move. This is very good cricket from Sachin Tendulkar. And it's not all that bad a delivery, but he's just waited on it and the placement just superb. And the fielders in that cover region are pretty close to each other. There's a backward point, there's a cover and an extra cover. And uh, Tendulka still found the gap right between cover and extra cover. Nothing that Russell Arnold could do. Only the run continues and Tendulka probably plays his favorite shot and picks up his seventh boundary. This is experience for you. He's also brimming with confidence. He's got a great start. Now that's very, very cheeky indeed. Took it from outside the off stump. He knew the ball is turning, played it with the turn. And played it fine enough to evade that fielder at short fine leg. And look how far across he took his front foot to be able to play it fine. That was lovely for runs. That's his 50. Tendulka has shown great inclination and determination in this innings. Has reached yet another landmark. 70th ODI 50. What a time to get it on his comeback. Seven boundaries and a six. A strike rate of 100. India needed an innings like this to begin this series. And so did this man on the screen. 50 or 50 deliveries. No. Giving the charge. Tim hit it cleanly, Tendulkar. Brings up the 100 for India. And in good time as well. The run rate of 6.19. Rahul Dravid would take it any day, any match of the series, 100 for one. Could be tight, hits it directly, question asked. Billy Barron, the umpire, is asked for the third umpire. Well, that is good cricket, but judging from the body language, 
of all the cricketers there in the middle. Sachin has probably made it, but it's good cricket. Now, these direct hits have a habit of being closer than you imagine. My goodness, that is close. It's, it's just a frame. He could well be in. He's not in here, but he's in there. They need a tighter frame. One frame back. It's just a matter of one frame, Shiva. I mean, how tight is that? Can't give that out as far as I'm concerned. When does the bail come off? Just now, and his bat is in. Difficult one for the third umpire. Shivram, the third umpire. From this angle, the bail seems to have moved when the bat is on the line, but does the bail come right off is the question. And when it does, he's in. But this is a real tight one. I think it's got to be dislodged completely, not partially. Difficult one. What's he going to do? Stalled in. That is close. Too close for comfort. But there you can see the roar that's gone around the ground. Sachin Tendulkar is not out now. He's got the benefit of the doubt, Shiva. He certainly has. This time, he's tried to clear the man at mid-off and just did. Shamin Dabas can't get there. He's also fortunate to pick up a boundary. Tendulkar. I think Tendulkar judged it right. It was the Dusra. He wanted to go on the straight field. But the ball turned across and he just got the splice. This was the Dusra. Didn't quite get it in the meat of the bat, but yet managed to just fall behind Vas, who was quite thought, uh, felt that he was under control till the ball just kept going away from him. So the Sri Lankans looking to pull this back at this stage. Big hit. Sex for it. Mm. It had the height. It had the distance as well. And the hundred run partnership between these two. Patan, real youthful exuberance, took on the challenge. There was a man down at deep long on, but he was prepared to take him on and um, cleared the boundary just over the man. Again, Dilshan, not a great spinner of the ball like Muralidharan, so he could get up to the pitch of it and uh, very good use of the feet. That's 50. So it's a very fine innings by uh, Irfan Patan. He's been sent out to do a job and he's done it so very effectively. And this really is uh, something which uh, India should be very happy about. Down the track and a good hit. Something's gonna happen. <laughs> One bounce over the rope. And pressure on the bowler straight away. It's very well hit indeed. In fact, uh, it was hit straight down the ground. He really didn't attempt to hit it across the line. It was pitched up, used his feet well, as you could see. Very good use of the feet and hit it uh, straight down the ground. This time, even bigger. I've got a chance here. Just missing it. Up on my toes in the commentary box. But that's a massive hit by Patan. A boundary. And now a six. Beautiful time. A lot of expression about the shot, as you will see. Again, great use of the feet. It was coming in our direction into the commentary box. But just veered away. But superbly struck six. Only two balls, Ranjit, and something's happened. Ten. That's another big. The biggest of the lot. Plenty of exercise for Billy. And uh, this ground in Nagpur has erupted. It's the crowd certainly on its feet, as you would see, as uh, the Sri Lankans are under siege here from uh, young Irfan Patan. Plenty of fear, plenty of expression, and he's certainly giving this crowd a huge break.
pads, a loud shout. And did he get some bat on it? He wasn't all that far forward, Tendulkar. There was quite a bit of turn here for Dilshan. And uh, one got the feeling that uh, there may have been too much turn. Hey, well, that's... Uh, Six. Absolutely no respite for the bowlers. Tendulkar once again taking on Dilshan. Getting to the pitch of it, hitting with the spin. And again, a lot of power despite the fact that uh, still nursing that uh, injury of ease. It just bludgeoned it away, just hitting the meat of the bat. He's gone over the top, he hasn't quite got hold of it, but we'll get away with it. Things going right for Pathan and the Indians. There have been a number of occasions when something like that has happened. He's pulled that one and it's four. One bounce and out. It's too slow wicket to bowl short like that. And Pathan is in terrific form. Yes, any top order batsman would have been uh, proud of that shot. Very nicely onto the back foot, in full control, pivoting as soon as he made contact. And uh, he lead away from the field, it kept going away from Chandana. So Pathan now seeing the ball like a football and uh, playing some glorious shots. Pathan on 83, Tendulkar 91. He's wanting to go over the top and I think he's got to go, he's gone. Just what they needed. The Sri Lankans needed a wicket, Dilshan has provided it. Irfan going once again, wanting to go over the top, getting the outside edge of the bat and holding out to short third man. Magnificent innings uh, from uh, Irfan Patan, exactly what uh, the Indian team wanted. He came out there when the score was 41 and uh, Dilshan has finally got him out. Tried to hit again over the top on the offside and uh, offered a simple catch this time. Mahala Jayavodhana making no mistake. So Irfan Patan goes after 70 balls making 80.